Kherko, you worked as a paramedic in Libya. Tell us about what happened on the day of your kidnapping. They picked me up at the airport and we were just driving to the construction site. And the next moment, all hell broke loose. I heard the bullets on the car. Next moment, the car is sta- stationary. And uh, within seconds, there's people at the door trying to break in, trying to pull me out of the car. Obviously, you refuse. But uh, yeah, when they hit me and they, uh, two guys pointed their AKs at my head, I knew, okay, this is now... You can resist as much as you want, but uh, they're going to take you by force. Do you know where was the first location that they took you to after after taking you from the vehicle? They took me back into a body. You know, I spent the first month in the town, in a house. They locked me up in a room, uh, constant light on me with two of them sleeping next to me, uh, making sure that I don't do anything funny. It was horrific. Mm-hmm. 